All right, to all my NASCAR pick five players, this is the last, the very last time I will do a points update until the regular season is over. The next race, Daytona, a night race coming up next weekend. That's going to be the end of the regular season, and we will know after that race our round of 16. This is how it stands right now with one race to go in the regular season. First of all, I want to thank everybody that's played this contest this year. I went over my numbers. Let's see. I've had exactly, exactly 100 people play this contest this season so far. 100 different players. Now, some played once and never played again, but, hey, I, I want to thank everybody that's been a part of it, those who have stuck it out and, and continued to play and have continued to enjoy it. Thank you very much. I appreciate it, and I hope that you'll come back next year, next season, and we'll play this thing again. Going to be doing the same, the same setup, the same exact contest, but I think next season – It'll be even funner. It's going to be a full season. Hopefully, COVID will be gone and, and all of that. I'm hoping and we can kind of get back to normal. So we're going to have our round of 16 after this next race. We're going to know who's in there. Once our round of 16 is set, I will no longer be taking points. The only points that I'm going to, only people I'm taking points for after, you know, once the playoffs start are our playoff contenders. Everybody else, yes, you can continue to play, but only for diecasts until this season is over and we crown a champion. Um, once we crown a champion, we move on the next year and we start the whole thing over again. But we will have our round of 16 after this next and last regular season race. So as we sit right now after the Dover doubleheader, Sitting in first place, Anthony Farmer with 75 points, five playoff points. All these playoff points, that represents those who have won a contest. They have five playoff points going in. These are the only points that are going to matter going into the playoffs. Those who do not have a win, these regular season points go away. It's a reset. And... Um, these people are going to be ahead, obviously, but you can catch them. You can catch them. So uh, I've got people in here with wins who I've not seen lately. Guys like Stephen C., 32 regular season points. Haven't seen him play in a while. He got the win, so he's in there. If he does not play in the playoffs, he's going to get knocked out by one of these other people down here. Uh, let's see. Who else? Noah Velez. Kind of here and there. He'll play a little bit. 41 points. Um, you know, if you don't play, you're going to get knocked out come playoff time. That's all I can say. This is my only warning on that. Davis, recent winner. Just started playing recently. Doug Klein, <coughs> uh, kind of a part-timer, but uh, very, very good. He's got a win. Doug's been playing a lot more lately, and he's been moving up the ladder. So uh, we'll see how it goes. But Anthony Farmer in first place with 75 points. Very, very close, trying to close that gap. Kenny Hunt with 72 points. Got the five playoff points. Louis Gallardo, very, very strong performer. 67 points and the five playoff points. Josh Reedy, very solid. 62 points, five playoff points. Chasing positivity tied with him fourth and for uh, fourth place, actually, but earning a slot because of her points. Chasing Positivity, fifth, 32 points, five playoff points. Jackie Mama, strong all year long, 60 points, five playoff points. Also in that same bracketing, Blue Bayou Racing, recent winner, 60 points, five playoff points. Noah Velez, 41 points, five playoff points. Doug Klein, moving up the ladder, 40 points and five playoff points. Dave S, 39 points, 5 playoff points. Steven C, who I have not seen in a while. Got a player. You're going to get knocked out of the playoffs, man. Uh, Got to get in there come playoff time and uh, start competing. 
Steven C, 32 points, five playoff points. Moving down the ladder, overall, our regular season points leader, Tim Scott, 77 points without a win. Slick Track, super big-time competitor, always strong. Slick Track with 73 points. Brian Rooker, 14th position, um, 67 points. Him and Sarah C. in a tie for that slot. 67 points as well for Sarah C. Harvick Fan for Life rounds out the top 16 with 65 points. On the bubble, these are people that have to have a good Daytona come next weekend. Got to gain some points or possibly a win. Dominic Baker, 62 points. And John Brown, the two of you have some some ground to make up. Uh, need some points, need a really, really good race or possibly a win to get in. Or hope that uh, Harvick fan for life. Uh, that uh, he doesn't do so well. So, hey, that's how you're going to get in. A win gets you in, or, hey, you can possibly do it on points, but this is the round of 16 as it stands right now with one race remaining in the regular season. Thank you, all you guys who play. You know, good luck to you all. And uh, my next time I come to you, that's going to be our round of 16. And uh, points, regular season points, will be out the window for everybody else at that point. For everybody at that point, the only thing that will matter, playoff points. We're going to have 11 go in as it sits right now with five points. Everybody else will be starting from scratch. It's going to be a three-race shootout to get us down to the round of 12. So we'll see how it goes. Thank you guys for playing. This is the points picture, round of 16 what the uh, playoff picture looks like after the Dover doubleheader. You guys take it easy.